back home uh, in America, I, um, I, I used to go to this spoken word poetry cafe thing, and when you wanted to show that you really liked something, or a line really strikes something in you, or you just like feel something in your gut, just like make a sound, or snap, yeah, super <laughs> cheesy, or like, mm, or like just nod your head, because it's, it's a give and take, right? That's why we do this. Um, all right, so this first poem is very old, and it's about um, getting over someone you know you need to get over. They say when a female rhino finds a mate, she locates a comfortable hole in a tree and walls herself in. Surrounded by mud and wood, it's like she understands the importance of self-protection. I want to be a rhino. I want to hunt down homes within trees, collect roots and twigs, mix water with dirt. If it means I'll have the power of a rhino. Let me grow thicker skin and live in a tree trunk. If it means someone could love me at branch length. I want to be a rhino. I want to live by myself, but without the loneliness the loneliness. I, I felt it this morning while sitting in a Starbucks. I sneezed. I sneezed and no one blinked an eye. There was no gesundheit, no God bless you. I actually had to bless myself. Bless me! <laughs> I said, smiling and how silly I sounded. And you weren't there to laugh. They say that otters hold hands in the night to avoid losing each other. Now, I've never been a strong swimmer, but I will tread water for days if it means I can spend another night holding you, you, that person who understands all my thoughts within one glance, that person that knows how much I hate pickles, who knows my birthday like it was his own, knows when I'm smiling through a telephone call, knows my dreams as if he had been one of the sheep that had led me there. Knows how afraid I am of bridges, how afraid I am of failing, looking like a fool. I had no one to bless me. Why can't we be more like otters, limbs intertwining so we don't drift apart? I yearn to float in water with you, feel the cacophony of kisses, follow the morning, and I'll find everything with you. The realest person I've ever known. Realer than the drool on your pillow. Realer than laughing so hard you pee a little. A rumbling stomach in a quiet room, a rug burn, and remembering the year we didn't speak, and trying to forget that it happened, and trying not to forget it happened, and then trying to forget it happened all over again. I want to be a rhino, and all my stories could simply seep into my wrinkles. These stories weren't meant to be. These stories, they were meant to be worn as camouflage, a way to hide from poachers or predators. Then again, they say that if you inject a single gram of King Cobra venom, it'll kill a person 150 times over. That gives me a hundred and fifty more chances to reincarnate, come back as a rhino. <laughs>